to eradicate poverty and hunger by 2030. Um, so there's more political will than ever. There's more will globally than ever. Um, we'll distribute these meals to communities where there's high rates of food insecurity. We focus on programs that provide transformational change for people. So mostly school feeding programs, vocational training, uh, maternity health, things like that that really the impact goes far beyond the meals. And I'll tell you a quick story about the impact of just the protein and the nutrients in these meals. There was a boy named Miguel, and this story, I heard this story uh, from a friend of ours uh, at Leonardo's Home of Hope, which is one of our partners. He told me a story about a boy named Miguel. That's my name. Could have been me if I was born at a different time in a different place, right? Uh, Miguel was about five years old. Uh, he was undernourished, uh, stunted growth, so he actually looked younger than he actually was. Um, but then his entire body was covered in skin, skin lesions. The largest organ on his body was dying. And uh, he came in with the artist home of hope in Honduras, and um, the doctors at, at the clinic treated him for infection, and they provided him two, they provided his family two boxes of the meals we're gonna pack. You see all those boxes back there? That's what we're gonna pack tonight before we leave. So two of those boxes changed this boy's life. After three months of eating Stop Hunger Now meals, just the nutrients and the protein that he wasn't receiving prior to these meals completely healed his skin, his eyes got brighter, his hair got shinier, completely changed his life. If you do want to see some before and after pictures, I have those and they're quite astonishing. Um, but that just shows you, we're going to have a lot of fun today and we're going to be, it's real simple. We're just scooping meals and weighing them and packing them up and we're going to have a lot of fun. We're going to crank up some tunes, so, you know, dance, goof off, have a good time. Um, but just understand that, that as we do this, we are really impacting people's lives in a meaningful and, and, and legitimate way. So, um, like I said, I'll be making the rounds, but I want to get you guys started. Um, anybody that's working, go ahead and come on over. And I want to put six people around. Or let's do five. I don't think we have enough for six. Let's do five people around each funnel. So you're going to start. 